It's an unprecedented situation for Spain's royal family. Princess Cristina now faces preliminary charges in a financial corruption scandal that's been swirling around her husband. When they married in 1997, this former professional handball player and his Spanish princess won over the Spanish media and the public. But how things have changed. The son-in-law of Spain's king, Iñaki Dangarín, has already been questioned in court twice over allegations that he misused millions of euros of public money. Now his wife, Princess Cristina, is due to appear in court too. The king's son-in-law, Iñaki Dangarín, had a company called NOS with his business partner, Diego Torres. They organized sporting events for the regional governments of the Balearic Islands and Valencia. The allegation is that they charged those governments massively inflated prices, siphoning off millions of euros of public money. Reacting to the news that Princess Christina will appear in court, the royal household said it was surprised, but that it respected the decision. <laughs> The case has angered a country struggling with deep recession. The Socialist Party asks for respect because in Spain the law is the same for everyone. The princess must appear before Judge Jose Castro on April the 27th on complicity charges in a pre-trial investigation. After a two-year probe, Spaniards want justice. I thought she would not be a suspect because she's a princess, but well, if she's guilty, she should accept responsibility. It's logical because of her relationship with Erdan Garin. It's logical that she's been charged. The royal family has tried hard to distance itself from Erdan Garin. He's been banned from royal events and photographs of him have been removed from the official website. He denies any wrongdoing.